The next thing we're going to do is create a new page. So we'll click Pages and add a page. And this is going to be a standard page. Give the page a name. I'm going to put my education history here. I'm going to use short header. You can use whatever you want. Now in advanced settings, we want to give the page a title so it will appear on the title bar. We'll save that. Enter a header. And we'll drag a text box. Now I've got two different universities I'm entering information for, and I'm going to put it in two different text boxes, and in a minute you'll see why. Now I'm going to add my university logos and the image. Don't drag it into the text box, but beside it. Now the next image we'll put beside the second text box, which is why we created two text boxes. We couldn't do this if it was all in one text box. Now let's drag this over so it'll look a little neater. Now the next thing I'm going to do is create a footer. Because we're doing our, our own custom footer, rather than using the built-in Weebly way of doing it, we're going to have to do this on every page but that's not a big problem.